aircraft is used at 420 knots at low level. Um, a cruise speed of 300 uh, gives significant enhancements in terms of fuel saving. So with the Reds away and clear, returning to us later, now back to solo fast jets and back to one of the very best solo fast jets. An incredibly capable aeroplane, an incredibly combat proven aeroplane in all sorts of recent operational theatres. And one that in the display we're about to see shows all the attributes that make it one of the best multi-role, or as its manufacturer calls it, omni-role combat aircraft available in the world today. An absolutely stunning demonstration, full of Gallic panache. It comes to us from the French Air Force.
seven other platforms with both the French Air Force and the French Navy. It could involve air-to-air -air combat missions, conventional air-to-ground missions, nuclear strike, reconnaissance, anti-shipping strike, and they can also fly the so-called buggy-buddy refueling role. And it was designed right from the start to be exactly that vertical.
and concluded like Salo Turk earlier with a split S manoeuvre to land in the gear coming down now. He's been uh, well taught that book because Captain Jean-Pierre Martinez, Marty, the previous Rafale display pilot, is his coach for this season. And certainly the influence is very obvious to see as Captain Sebastian Natibel brings in to land the French Air Force Rafale C. This is the single seat version. The French also fly the Tucson Rafale C, which they originally thought of as a combat capable conversion trainer. But in fact, they now have started using that rather like the US Air Force's. US Air Force uses the F-15 Strike Eagle with uh, weapon system officer in the back. How quickly that aircraft has uh, reduced its speed, kind of control, it could easily have turned off at uh, 2,000 feet off.